Hello friends, the HPTO is excited to be partnering with our educators to bring you this special series, Fireside Stories. Throughout December, we will release a video of one of our Hopkinton School staff members reading a story. It is such a nice way to help us feel connected during these unprecedented times. Before we begin, I would like to take a moment to encourage your family to become a member of the HPTO. The money we raise during the year through fundraising and membership provides each school with a budget the following year. Each school budget ranges between $15,000 and $25,000. Our impact in the schools is great, and we want to be able to continue to offer the same financial support to our schools as we have in the past. Fundraising events, book fairs, and extracurricular classes are impacted, so your membership in the HPTO is more important than ever. We encourage you to please take a moment to visit www.hptoonline.com and renew your membership. The $25 membership fee means a lot to every one of the schools in Hopkinton. Please consider making this investment in our children's education. In the meantime, get cozy while you enjoy a story read by one of our amazing Hopkinton educators. Hi, boys and girls, it's Mrs. Moriarty. I have a story I'd like to share with you. This book is called How to Heal a Broken Wing. It's written and illustrated by Bob Graham. How to Heal a Broken Wing. How to Heal a Broken Wing, Bob Graham. Boys and girls, pay attention to the illustrations in this story. It will really help you understand everything that's happening because there are not a lot of words in this story. Here I go. High above the city, no one heard the soft thud feathers against glass. No one saw the bird fall. No one looked down. Except Will. Will saw a bird with a broken wing. and he took it home. A loose feather can't be put back. But a broken wing can sometimes heal rest and time and a little hope. A bird may fly again.
Will opened his hands. And with a beat of its wings, the bird was gone. Thanks for listening, boys and girls.